Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Shark Bites, the best place online for you to get your shark fix. So it's been a little while since we last did a Shark and Ray viral video compilation and I've been itching to show you some of the craziest videos that I've been watching over the last few months. And if you missed our last viral videos compilation, you can click this little link here and give it a watch. Today we've got tiger sharks, hammerheads, spotted eagle rays and plenty more, so let's not waste any time and check them out. First up, we've got another great white shark video. I feel like I'm always starting with great whites on these viral video compilations, but that must just be because they're always doing pretty crazy stuff. Posted by Charlie Hooveneers on his Twitter timeline, we can see a baited remote underwater video setup, otherwise known as a bruv, sitting and filming a fish assemblage in the water column. Before the fish assemblage scatters and a great white surges from below to rip the bait cage from the pole. <laughs> Let's have another look at that. That is incredible. Bruvs are used pretty regularly by scientists and they're used to measure biodiversity of shark and ray species in different underwater habitats, but that is incredibly rare to see. And sorry, Charlie, I don't think you're getting your bait cage back anytime soon. <laughs> Up next, we have a video of a tiger shark and a turtle that went so viral back in December. And I must warn you, it's a little bit distressing to watch. The video posted by Kai Servants on Instagram shows a predation event from a tiger shark on a sea turtle. The sea turtle close to the boat desperately attempts to board the drop ladder to try and get away from the tiger shark. Sea turtles are pretty regular prey species for tiger sharks, with the tiger shark teeth perfectly designed for grasping onto and crunching the shell of the sea turtle. And while it's a little sad to see, this is nature in full force. I did read later on that this sea turtle was actually saved by those filming it, and while I don't really agree with that, it looks like the lucky turtle lives to see another day. Next, we're heading to Colombian waters where a fantastic video was captured by Brian Green of one of my favorite ray species. The video shows a gorgeous spotted eagle ray munching in and around the sand for small invertebrates and crustacean species to feed on, being closely followed by a large assemblage of fish species. Quite a few people have pointed out that this looks a lot like the spotted eagle ray, otherwise known as Mr. Ray from Finding Nemo. This guy, remember him? In reality, what's really happening here is these fish species are hanging around the back of the spotted eagle ray to try and scavenge some food scraps. Spotted eagle rays are notoriously messy eaters and scraps are pretty easy to come by for any nearby fish, but what an amazing behavior to catch on film. Over to the Seychelles now, where the roles between predator and prey seem to have been reversed between this shark and a pretty big barracuda. This short video shows what I believe to be a juvenile lemon shark peacefully swimming in the shallows before being utterly ambushed by a monstrous barracuda. <laughs> what? That is wild. Juvenile lemon sharks are common residents in the shallow mangrove waters around tropical islands in the Atlantic. They're born in these mangrove habitats and spend the first few years of their lives living in relative safety from larger predators. Although there is never truly any safe place in the ocean, thankfully this little lemon did survive the attack. So earlier I showed you that pretty grim video of the tiger shark winning the battle against the sea turtle, but this next video shows this predator-prey interaction from a different perspective. This animal-born camera footage captured by a team of researchers from Murdoch University in Western Australia shows a flat-back sea turtle defending itself from a tiger shark attack. The brave sea turtle actively charges the tiger shark and even attempts to bite it to try and prevent the attack. I absolutely love animal-born camera footage and this video is so cool. It really shows the constant battles these two species are having out in the oceans. Still feeling sorry for that turtle earlier? I'm not sure anymore. Over to Miami now, where some drone footage captured a very close encounter between a pretty large hammerhead and a completely oblivious swimmer. The drone footage shows the curious hammerhead swimming peacefully around this Miami swimmer, who is completely unaware the shark is mere feet away from him. After a few passes, the hammerhead continues on its way. I mean, that swimmer, what does he think the drone is doing? Does he think the drone is coming closer just to film him having a happy swim? How did he not realize something else was going on? In reality, this video is just another peaceful encounter between sharks and humans, and we love to see that. Now, this next one isn't a viral video per se, but it definitely was a viral photo that was doing the rounds just before Christmas. So let's have a look. 
After some extreme weather caused flash flooding in Queensland, Australia, many residents living next door to bodies of water seem to lose parts of their gardens. Here we can see a photo of what is claimed to be a bull shark casually swimming right next to this man's back garden. Now I'm always pretty wary of photos like this because they are very good at going viral but are very rarely true. For example, we have the photo here of the shark swimming down a flooded road which always seems to do the rounds on social media when there's been a storm or a flood, but it's 100% fake. While it is true that bull sharks can live in river and estuarine habitats, I'm definitely not convinced by this photo. There have been some questions raised about the shadows being cast by the tree and also the shark, but the main gripe I have with it are the positioning of the fins. The first dorsal is way too close to the second dorsal for this to be a real bull shark. Here you can see the normal distance between the first and second dorsal in bull sharks, and then when you compare that to the viral photo, well, I'll let you make your own minds up. I'm happy to be proved wrong here, and if anyone has any video footage of this incident, then I'd love to see it. And finally, we've got this pretty crazy footage uploaded to Facebook of an oceanic white tip shark getting up close and personal with an underwater photographer. The video taken in an unknown location shows the oceanic white tip repeatedly swimming pretty close to this scuba diver and his camera equipment. After a brief visit up to the surface marker boy, he comes back down for another look at the diver and his camera before a shove in the gills sends him away. Oceanic white tips are occasionally known to be somewhat aggressive, particularly when there is food in the water. There have been a number of oceanic white tip attacks on swimmers in the Red Sea, particularly in Sharm El Sheikh back in 2010. There is an argument to be had that the oceanic white tip may have been attracted to the electrical impulses being emitted by the underwater camera equipment. All we can say is thankfully no one was hurt in this pretty wild encounter caught on film. And there we have it folks, those are your craziest shark and ray viral videos from the last few months or so. Did you have a favourite? Are you team turtle or team shark? Did you think the bull shark swimming in the back garden was real or fake? I want to know what you think in the comments below. And as always, if you enjoyed this video, please do give it a like and don't forget to subscribe to the Shark Bites channel below where you can stay up to date with all of our latest videos from season two. Until then, see you next time.